how to make money on Upwork as a web scrapping specialist. Hey guys, welcome to this new video. In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can make money using this platform. So let's get started by creating our account. So here, make sure to join as a freelancer, looking for work, then click on apply as a freelancer. Then you'll proceed to fill in the usual information, first name, last name, email, and so on. Then you click on create my account. For me, I'm going to log in. I've already created my account. So here, I'm going to continue with my email and my password as well. Then click on login. And after that, you proceed to create your profile. So this is the last step of creating the profile. So let's go back to start from the beginning. To start from the first step. So here, this is the first step of creating the profile. So let's get started. And here we have a question and we have three answers to go through. So make sure to choose the answer that fits your situation. So have you freelanced before? Choose the answer that fits you. Then you do the same with this other question. What's your biggest goal for freelancing? Choose one of these answers, then, then click on next. To proceed to the next question, which is how would you like to work? So here you have three answers. And in my advice, it's better to choose them all. So keep that in mind. And after that, click on next to create a profile. So here you have three options to choose from in order to create your profile. So you can either import your resume from LinkedIn or you can upload your resume if you have it on your in a file on your desktop or you can fill it out manually. It will take less than five minutes. So I prefer to fill it out manually. Click on start a new profile. And here you enter your skill, which is a web scrapping specialist. Then click on next to add your experience. So here add your previous work experience in here. After that, you proceed to add in your education. So here you add your education history. And after that, you proceed to add in the languages that you can speak. So here, we have English and it's a must. All profiles include this. And here you choose your level in English. Then you can add other languages if you can speak them, obviously. So I'm going to add two more. My native language, which is Arabic and French, which is a language that I have studied in school. And here my level in Arabic is native and my level in French is basic then click on next to add your skills so here you enter your skills in here you can and here you have some suggested skills for you like like web scrapping data scrapping web application so i'm going to choose the three of them this is just an example and here as you can see the maximum amount of skills you can add is 15 skills so you cannot add more than that guys so make sure to use these 15 skills wisely then click on next to write an overview so here you write about you to tell the world all about yourself and this is an example of a bio as you can see i'm a developer experienced in building websites for small and medium-sized business and etc and as you can see a small text and some bullet points so guys, in order to enter a good bio for your profile, just go to ChatGPT and enter I'm a web scrapping specialist. Give me a bio for my Upwork profile and you'll get a very decent bio. You'll just need to copy and paste it in here. And if you want, you can add some personal information to it. Then you're good to go. For me, I'm going to take Marty's bio because going to ChatGPT will make the video very long. Then click on next to choose your categories. So here you can search for a service or you can just use the suggested services for you. So here I'm going to choose these suggested services. Then click on next to set your rate. So I'm going to go with $20 per hour. 
directly connects to add your photo and location so here fill this information and for your profile picture make sure to show clients the best version of yourself it must be an actual photo of you logos clip art group photos and digitally altered images are not allowed so keep that in mind guys and after you're done with creating your profile I'm going to show you the strategy that I use personally in order to improve this profile so what I do basically is I search for my competitors and I find or I look for the highest earner amongst them then I copy what is he doing in his profile I see first what is he, what is working for him how he talks about his skill in his bio and I analyze his profile and if I find something that works for him I apply it to my profile as well so here we're going to search for the highest earner in here so we have this one who earned more than five hundred thousand dollars and he gets paid forty dollars per hour and this one earns just ten grand a hundred grand so the highest earner for now is the one with 500 grand so let's keep looking if we can find someone with more than a five hundred thousand dollars so here i think the one with 500 grand is the highest earner in this category this one earned more than three hundred thousand dollars but he still out earned by the first one we saw so here let's check the fifth page so let's go back to the first one it's where we have our highest earner here the first one so this is the highest earner make sure to use the strategy that i showed you on him and make sure to improve your profile and guys if you want to find more work easily in this platform just go to find work click on find work for your skills and here enter your skill in this search box and you will see all of the listed jobs that are looking for someone with your skills to hire and that's it guys for today's video don't forget to like the video subscribe to my channel and share the video with your friends